Hi guys, it's Kashas. Um, just uh, had my first bike ride on one of those jump bikes, the Red Lime electric pedal assisted ones. You can hire, they're dotted around the city and you can just hire them. And uh, it's had about a nine minute ride. It was easy to unlock. First, you need to find where it is, download the Lime app and then find where they are. Once I found where the bike was, then um, press the button and it's reserved for you for 10 minutes. Then you've got to scan the code and then, you know, then you're ready to go almost. Adjust the seats and stuff. It's pedal assist, so make sure when you're taking off, you've got enough space to sort of go, like clear the runway space, basically, because you don't want to crash into someone's car. First time riding, a, well, not my first time, but I don't normally ride a town bike with that sort of handlebar position. So it was quite cool, actually. Felt a bit fun, could keep my back straight and stuff like that. Um, the electric on the bike was quite good, very powered. In terms of value, eight minutes costs two pounds thirty-five in total, including your VAT and your unlocking fee. So, not you know, don't think it's quite good in terms of that kind of value for money. Um, you can get around London much cheaper on the train, um, or even the TFL bikes. So, I think for value for money, TFL bikes is a lot better. In terms of flexibility, being able to just drop the bike anywhere, these bikes are quite good. In terms of the parking, there was a bit of a faff trying to park it at the end. I kept pressing end ride. And I didn't know what it wanted me to do. Um, so then I took out the cord and put the cord back in. And I think that's what needed to do. That made some noises. And then I needed to take a photo of it and to show that it's been done. So anyway, yeah, I just thought I'd share my first experience on a Lime jump bike. I mean, I, I normally ride a regular pedal-assisted bike, um, which is a hybrid. Um, though recently I have not used the pedal assist so much. I've just more been using it as a manual bike, which is great because the... It's a good workout for your legs because the battery makes the bike really heavy. Um, so it's not like riding a regular bike. Anyway, so I just thought I'd share that. Um, I might try an electric scooter soon, hire an electric scooter, but you need to upload your driver's license. And I didn't have that at the time. I was in a bit of a rush. So yeah, so yeah, try it out, guys. Check it out. Um, always ride safe. Always use your helmet if you have one. Um, always check your blind spot. Um, remember, you're on the road. Always follow the rules of the road. It's just... It's a given. You see a lot of people out there riding their bikes willy-nilly and going this way, that way, that way, that way. It's as though they've not really known. Uh, they don't know the highway code. Personally, I would say if you're going to let your kids ride, um, give them a few driving lessons first. Or at least teach them the rules of the road. Um, and then let them ride it. When I say give your kids a driving lesson, I don't mean put them in behind the wheel. I mean basically teach them the stuff uh, so they can understand what's going on on the road around them. Okay, guys. Ciao for now.